Charles and William snapped Meghan video call, fearing she would not be alone. King Charles III and Prince William snapped a crucial video call with Meghan Markle over fears that she wouldn't be alone. An explosive new book reports that the Duchess of Sussex wanted to dial into the Sandringham Summit of, from Canada, but Charles and William feared the call would not be wise as they dealt with the Sussex's future in the royal family in January 2020. The late Queen Elizabeth II was similarly concerned that details of the conversation would be leaked and had the Maxit Summit's room swept for bugs, according to veteran royal correspondent Robert Jackson. In his new book, Our King Charles III, The Man and the Monarch, he revealed Mr. Jackson said, Key members of the royal family feared Meghan's video link could also be hacked if she were allowed to die into the summit, Mr. Jackson wrote. There was a suggestion that Meghan should join Charles, William and Harry via video link from Canada, but the Queen ruled that her attendance in any form was not necessary as Harry would represent her. It was also felt that a video link wouldn't be secure as Charles and William wouldn't be able to tell if the meeting was being recorded or if Meghan has had anyone else listening in as to spoke. The new book, serialized by the Daily Mail, has lifted the lead on several key moments in the split between the Sussexes and the rest of the royal family. Prince Harry was left infuriated by King Charles, saying he could not afford to pay for Meghan, according to the royal author. The monarch reportedly dropped the bombshell when he said he couldn't afford to pay for the Duchess of Sussex as well as Camilla and the Wells' family. Harry and Meghan's relationship with key members of the royal family has been on the downturn ever since the snap. Prince Harry made several accusations against King Charles, Prince William and other royals in the explosive memoirs pair, including details of an altercation with William that ended in a dog bowl being smashed. The Sussex's Netflix docu series Harry and Meghan also did little to cool tensions with his palace when it was released in December. In the series, Harry accused his older brother's office of briefing against him in the press and even went as far as to claim Charles and William screamed at him in the meeting about his move to the US. He said, It was terrifying to have my brother scream and shout at me and my father saying things that just simply weren't true and my grandmother quietly sitting there. The Queen said Harry and Meghan's criticism of the royal family were quite mad. Mr. Jobson reports as she was privately puzzled by the couple's antics. The latest revelations about the Sussex's split with the royal family came as Harry and Meghan are set to reveal whether or not they will attend the coronation of King Charles. The palace expects Harry to attend the monumental occasion on May 6, but doubts still linger over whether Meghan will make an appearance at the event. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are thought to be very furious that they would not be allowed to stand on the Buckingham Palace balcony if they attend. King Charles III is only allowing walking royals to appear on that balcony for the iconic wave to the crowds gathering on the mall. Express has told by, was told by royal sources that Harry and Meghan's reply to the coronation invite is expected in a few days' time.